Ah. <laughs> Music came in a bit. Hello. Hello. A tiny, tiny, tiny bit of your chair is cut off, but it really doesn't matter too much. I know. Oh, it's, I can fix it a tiny bit. There, yeah, that's it. Is that yeah, it was just the very my... top of Oh, looking a bit grey today. Must be all these ghosts. <laughs> to possess the webcam feed. <laughs> I have a little bit. I think my white balance is a bit off. But, I don't know. Anyway, so... Uh, stream, stream's looking okay. Is it looking okay? Is it sounding okay? Because I had to screw the sound It, it is, but you're probably... You may be a little bit quieter than me. Too quiet? Uh, you might be a little bit quieter than me, based on the... Too quiet. I, I don't know if it's too quiet. There, yeah, I'll probably... bump it up to what it usually is. There we go. Because my mic's a little bit higher than it usually is. Um, um, okay, so, last time, wait, what happened last time? <laughs> oh, shit, last we're all in the fought. house. <laughs> they, they decided to get a boat and get the hell off the island. Yes, yes, except now we need to do a thing. Um, we need to do a thing, don't we? We need to, like, um, bunker? I want to say bunker. Mm-hmm. Is there a thing to do with the bunker? That we need to, like, open, but it needs to be open in a specific way, isn't it? Like with the group splitting up or something like that and Alex had a vision of Ren drowning but we totally decided to just ignore it and it's fine <laughs> <laughs> it'll be fine it'll be fine he was being a dick <laughs> we're not speaking to him right now <laughs> um, we'll, st we'll talk to him when we get off this island um, so right now what I'm doing is just basically trying to clean up a little bit I've done some of that before I started the stream, so you notice I got one, two, three, four letters out of thirteen. Three, six, nine, twelve, thirteen. So that's good. Um, it won't tell me how many anomalies I have unless I see the map screen, and I can't view the map screen, which is a bit okay. annoying. Um, yeah, it only seemed to pop up when there was a critical event. Yeah, I can't. I can't even use the M key. Uh, just to let you know. Our friend Susan has started watching. Ah, funny that. <laughs> yeah. I guess I guess your app. Yeah, it it's my app. Uh, uh, also, uh, a tiny bit of your microphone is in the shot for the webcam feed. It's really tiny. There, there that's it. Yep, <laughs> just a little bit of the metal. Um, left or right? Left or right? Oh man. Uh, well, this is just exploring time, so um, may as well cover all. Oh, it's right the gang. Then. Let's go right then. <laughs> stay away from the Scooby Gang. Yeah, stay away from the Scooby Gang because that's going to trigger um, story, isn't it? And I don't want to do that just yet. I want to explore a little bit more. That's your, you think this may be your last chance? I think it might be my last chance, yeah. Okay, if there's a letter in the area... You can tune the radio to specific frequency and there'll be a clue. Okay. Um, but, um, yeah. But the letters are like super, super obvious. <laughs> I think the thing that you might need to watch out for are the anomalies. It should be so like we're looking a little for those little rocks. Yeah, keep an eye out for them little rocks. I don't know how much help you'll be though if the screen's like this big for you. <laughs> Show it out in chat if you guys see it. Yes. Or if Susan somehow misses a letter, but that doesn't seem like that. We turn. Under the ladder, below the tango. Under the ladder, Oscar. below the tango, whiskey. Oscar, Echo. whiskey, Echo, Romeo. Romeo. Under the tower, okay then. Eye oh, yeah. out for rocks. Is that a rock? It does look rock like. But is this a background rock? <laughs> oh, no, it's a, it's a. It's a background rock! Oh no! Yes! Oh no, it's a real rock. Oh, okay. Cool. 
So that is... I've come prepared, by the way. <laughs> Just... I like it. I like it. <laughs> oh, all right then. Let's go to the scary up. building. Gonna bring in the alien. Yeah. Oh no! Wait, under the tower. Uh, so it must be here. Under the tangle. Tango, Oscar, whiskey. <laughs> there it is. Bing. Uh, the communication school here mm. taught them how to make codes. Communication school taught them how to make code. Um, how to make codes. Cool. Um, I'm just gonna collect them all and then I'll read them all when it's done. You know. Sure. Sure. Um, I, I'm mostly. I mean, I'm a, a reasonably fast reader, so I caught most of that. Uh, Johnny has joined us. Hi, Johnny. Um, I'm just uh, cleaning up here, like trying to over. get all the collectibles and stuff. I feel like you need all the collectibles for the good ending. <laughs> you don't know that though. I don't know that, but I feel like that. I feel like you this feel is... like that may be the case. I feel but like that might be the case. Previous games you've played. Yeah, but then again, it's like you know, is this game screwing with you know the um, conventions? Yeah. It doesn't seem to have done so far. So we're on clean up duty right now, and then we'll Uniform, probably Cold, proceed. India, Uniform, India, Delta, Delta, based on what we know. Guide. If you want directions, this guide can help. Okay. Ah, oh. She, well, There's one right there. brought her friend Anna here to help, I guess. Oh, cute drawing. That is a really cute drawing. Oh, like cute drawing. Oh. I'm trying to prevent Anna from ever coming. Oh, okay. Cute drawing with sinister connotation. I know. <laughs> um, the, the juxtaposition of Oxen 3. I, <laughs> I know. Um, well, let's go inside this cre creepy building. Some stuff happened in here earlier. Oh, yeah, shit went down in here. That was awful. I think that's probably one of the worst things that's happened so far. Um, although, actually, I don't know. The stuff in the house was pretty um, creepy. Pretty awful. Oh. My God. What? I've got some breaking sad news. This is legit sad. What? Peter Salas, the voice of Wallace, has passed away. Oh no! He was 96! 96, <laughs> man! He had a good run! Oh man, Godspeed. Grow me it! <laughs> oh no! Oh, that's really sad. He was like, it was like, who will sur who will survive? It's like the uh, if you've seen that episode of The Simpsons, the Hellfish Bonanza, it's like uh, it's like this treasure where when they all pass away, they can open. Oh the... yeah 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 yeah. Yeah, it's I like remember. the cast of The Last of the Summer White. <laughs> <laughs> We've got like the sacred treasure that they'll open that's been in there since like 1942 or something. Um, hey Johnny, if that's how you like to spend your time in the privacy of your own home. Well, more power to you. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's a bit weird. <laughs> that's, a, that's a classy note to end Peter Salas' death on there, Johnny. <laughs> to be fair, he is a few seconds behind, so... <laughs> that's true, that's true. That's Although, true. you know, not as many seconds as previously, though. No, it hasn't proved since we've become a Twitch affiliate. <laughs> boo, 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 boo. <laughs> <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> just gonna, we just have a soundboard. Oh god, our soundboard would be terrible. It'd just be lots of me like shouting at Dean and like <laughs> Verity getting really angry about chicken horse. And... <laughs> it would be actually. Uh, Johnny says, "How is Twitch's Android app so effing bad?" I know, right? It doesn't sound <laughs> good from what I'm hearing. Yes, <laughs> it's it's annoying me greatly as well. Like I watch in the stream on the on the app and like it does what it needs to do most of the time, but there are other times where you're just like, oh, it's, it's sort of weird delays and weird. Just does it's not weird even that. Things. It's just awkward to kind of navigate, like mm, not as intuitive as you would think it would be. Like trying to get to somebody's profile and see more details and stuff is like a bit of a nightmare. Time for, time Lina, for Lima, S L E Echo, E, Echo, e Papa. In the time, middle of things. time for sleep in the middle of things. Okay, so we. Like Looking bed. for a bed, then. Is 
So Johnny, have you played this game? I can't remember if she joined us before. No, I don't think Johnny's been with us on this particular journey. On this particular journey. Have you thought about what your next journey might be? Um, I did wonder about playing like Inside or Event Zero, but I feel like I should do something like purely happy. <laughs> <laughs> that might be all right. Yeah. <laughs> Um, and not something so like creppy and spoopy. I can't tell if these are like background rocks or like actual rocks. Yeah. It's hard. It's hard. Oh, okay. Well, here are the beds. Oh, and there it is. Oh, it says that the the base first found the ghosts' messages here. The base first found the ghost messages here. Okay. Calvin Gilbert. Oh look, it's one of them um, doors. Bloom. What horror awaits us? Oh, oh, okay. Oh, it's a rock! It's a rock! Oh, anomaly thing. Also, Come welcome on. to the chat, uh, X Captain Forty Two. Ah. Okay. Hi, X Captain. Okay. Best walls and government, maybe. I just want you to have a good time. Like this. I think there's something down there. There's only one answer, but I want to hear what your answer is. <laughs> oh no, there's stuff happening. Sorry. Hmm. Jason stuff? Oh. Jason! Really <laughs> God. I, was, I was gonna say something very self deprecating. It was like, well, we hardly get any viewers, so it's a big deal. <laughs> you're, you're, it's a big you're, deal, you're, man. It's a big deal. It's a big deal. <laughs> we welcome all viewers. <laughs> we welcome all viewers here. Usually, if people don't want to get called out, then they don't respond to us. But, um. Yeah. Yeah. Although there was that person that time where they was just like, dude, I was trying to lurk. We were like, oops, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing a good job. <laughs> Don't! <laughs> oh, wait, this just. Oh, this popped me out on the other side of the tower. Um... How many you got left, letters wise? You've, <sighs> you've got to be getting there now. One, two, three, four, five letters left. Okay. I don't know how many good. anomalies, though. This is really annoying. <laughs> yeah, the anomalies make it a bit. It's like, I'm going to get to a map screen, I'm going to be like 11 out of 12 and go, no! <laughs> so before you were listening to your anomaly, which I didn't mean to interrupt, um, yeah. I was asking, what's your, what's, or not what's your, what's your favourite, uh, I mean, this is kind of the same question, what's the best Walsh and Gromit movie? And there's only one answer. Oh, I like the Were-Rabbit one. Is that your favourite? That is my favourite, yeah. Okay. But that's because, you know, rabbits. Even Were-Rabbits. <laughs> But um, the wrong trousers is pretty good. The wrong trousers is the correct answer. <laughs> it's like, you shut your mouth. <laughs> can I not? Can I, I can't get in there, can I? It's locked. Yeah. Is that a No, no uh, that's not a they're, they're all great. They're all they great. are all very, very good. Um, but I, uh, I, always, I, just, I, I always I, tend I, to kind of catch um, Wear Rabbit on TV a lot. Oh, okay, yeah. Um, uh, wrong just trousers does it. Um, Does it oh. for me because it's like the the guy who voices Wallace, yeah, is that right, Scott? Yes, Peter Salas. Peter Salas just died at the age of ninety six. He did as well. In Wallace and Gromit. Yes, as in Wallace and Gromit. Oh. Yeah, so that was our reaction. <laughs> <laughs> so we're talking about our um about our favorite Wallace and Gromit movies. Anything with cheese. Anything with cheese, isn't it? Not basically all of them. Yep. <laughs> I said I mean, where specifically rabbit? the first one was about cheese, very wrong specifically. But... Oh, wrong trousers. Okay, you have the correct answer, according to Scott. <laughs> what? That's the correct answer, according to Scott. I said, well, curse of the were-rabbit. No, 
but because I like rabbits. Shut up, I like that movie. <laughs> Robot trousers? Really? Yeah, but the bit where they go through the field with the carrots, that's really cool. <laughs> They're all good. They're all good. They're okay. All good. Uh, Chicken run's good as well. Chicken run. Um, I, uh, I really like the Shaun the Sheep movie as well. Uh, oh, Shaun the Sheep movie's fantastic. Like, it's that's, so good, isn't it? That's really good. Um, surprisingly good Christmas film is Arthur Christmas. I know it's oh. not claim. I know it's not the usual claymation, but it is the same style. Have uh, you, uh, Captain Oz? Have you ever played the Wallace and Gromit video game? No, I have uh, not. I what? have not. I own them all. You own them all. I own Wait, them all what, what, what is it? What is it? It's a, it was a five-episode Telltale series before oh, Telltale was it? hit it really big. Uh, unfortunately, Peter Salas does not voice Wallace in those because he was retired. So, does the guy who voices Wallace do a good job then? I think it's supposed to be acceptable, but I don't but know it's if you not, can ever replace not. that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty silly, apparently. Uh, so yeah, it was before Telltale really blew up. A penny for a... Uh, a penny for a whiskey, whiskey India, India, Cena, Hotel. Wish. Penny for a wish. So by the by okay, this well, well, maybe. Oh, yeah. They Oh, what? Wow! Whoa! <laughs> We're on fire tonight. Source of the temporal tear. There's time traveling ghosts. And she was absorbed into its ridge. This sounds good. Okay, I'm, I'm going to read them all in one go when we're done. Yes, let's do, um, a, let's do a, a group so, reading at the end. Yeah, group reading. It's like sit down. Susan's Monday reading hour. Monday tale. Yeah, Monday, so it was, you know, kind of like um, Jack and Ori or something. Oh no, okay. the old platformer for the PS2. <laughs> I am, I am not intimately familiar with that. <laughs> Is wow. there such a thing? That's a, that's kind of like awful and amazing at the same time. Is it any I good? Mean, is the real question. I, yeah, that's the real question. I mean, I know about the Wallace and Gromit, um, not cartoon maker, but it was like a, you can make your own little shorts on the PC. Uh, ah, there, it's called Wallace and Gromit Studio. Um, this goes up, doesn't it? And you can also go up and left, can't you? Uh, yes, I think that's correct. Should I go up and left? No, I should go down and left and then hopefully I'll pop out at the top or something. There was two PlayStation 2 games. It was the hardest game ever, apparently. Oh, there, were, there were two. There was one called Wallace and Gromit in Project Zoo. Uh, <laughs> which is a... A story where they take on uh, Feathers McGraw again. Oh my god. Antagonist of the wrong trousers. Uh, and there's also a 2005 game based on Curse of the Were Rabbit. Okay. Uh, and then I remember when I was younger playing uh, the Wallace and Gromit Fun Pack, uh, which had a. Yes, it was called Wallace and Gromit's Cracking Animator. That was it. And you could like make your own little shorts. Uh, it's kind of like the Simpsons cartoon studio, or Batman and Robin cartoon maker, or any of the other late 90s cartoon maker programs, of which there were quite a few, right? Um, Captain, what, what was difficult about this game? Climb, girl, climb, what are you doing? Oh. Oh my god! Like you can do it. I can't get out of this wall. There we you go. You can do it. Yay. <laughs> go out there. Okay, I see rocks up here, so I'm just gonna check these. I've probably done them already, but oh yeah, I've done them in ones already. There's something else up here, is there? Let's, um. You know, if there was gonna be a letter, it was gonna be at the end of this path. <laughs> Let's see. It'll be something like a romantic spot at the lovers. Oh, look, there you go. <laughs> Thank you so much. That's it. Lima, Echo, Foxtrot, Tango, Edge. Okay, at the Criff's left edge. There's an anomaly. Did you get that one yet? Yeah? yeah, I've got that one. Keep an eye out for them rocks. If it actually stays anomaly, does that mean you got it already? Yes. Okay, good. Uh, similar for this one. Should say. Yeah, 
so it pops up. But I bet the letter's like up here or some jazz, isn't it? Oh, that makes sense, yep. It was just one of those platformers that tried a little too hard to be challenging and ended up being too challenging. <laughs> so... Just went like all the way back, right? It's kind of a, a lot of platformers then. Out of the way, Jonas. We're done here. Keep up, keep up. <laughs> I got my letter. We're going. <laughs> um, okay, so... The music in this game is really good, by the way. Creepy, but um, really good. I was well, listening since I've to got it. no frame of reference, I just have to assume it's going. Um, I was listening to it on the um, train home, actually. Oh, the oxen free soundtrack. Yeah, the oxen free soundtrack. It's on Spotify. Oh, interesting. I was going to say, did you bother? Oh, I was like. Surprised? Did you rip that already? <laughs> <laughs> Stolen. Okay, is there anything here? No. No, 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 no. I can't see any rocks. Oh, uh, a British writer has also passed away. Oh. Erewhon dying. Oh, and um, a footballer, no? Yeah, there was a footballer this afternoon. Yeah. Um, let's see. I don't. I can't Jim pronounce Richard. his name. <laughs> yeah, no, I can't. Yeah, exactly. Oh, bless him. I can't pronounce his name. <laughs> I had to like look up a news article where they say his name. Um, uh, Helen Dunmore. Helen Dunmore. It's a British novelist. Um, this is my first playthrough, Captain. And I'm trying to collect all the collectibles just because I have a really nasty feeling. <sighs> <laughs> oh shit, I didn't want to go here, like, just yet. Anyway. Um, yeah, no, I'm trying to collect everything because I just have a really nasty feeling that I need to collect everything. Um, but do you? Maybe. But do I? Um, oh, I don't want to go here just yet. <laughs> He's like, oh yeah, the station, the place that we need to go to is like right there. And I'm like, nope. Oh, damn. can't go back. <laughs> oh what? You're locked into the endgame? Shite. I really hope I'm not locked into the endgame. Please don't let me be locked into the endgame. People lose their names. People lose their names and give them, and to, give them to Golf, Golf Romeo, Romeo, Alpha, Alpha Victor, for Graves. Echo. Uh, Ex-Captain asks, where in the story are you? Well, um, uh, we think we're just before the end game based on what I've read. I've read, I accidentally read a little bit about the end of the game. Um, we've uh, just finished the bit where shit got real in the house and we've decided to split up and sort out, what was it again? Uh, the underground bunker junk. Yeah. <laughs> the ghosts have been having a conversation with us as well. Oh, they, were, they tested us in the house and then they were like, oh. yo, Ooh, letter. stay out our, stay our way. And an anomaly. Okay, yeah, you, know, so you came here before for that anomaly. I remember that much. Did I? I honestly can't yes. remember. I remember those grapes. This game has just been week. a blur of terrifying event after terrifying event. You're close, but still a little ways away. Hmm. Okay, then. Okay. That's good to know, because I was, like, legit worried that I would accidentally lock myself into, like, an end game and then not be able to search for collectibles, which is why I'm kind of putting off, like, really doing anything. Yeah. Like significant, if that makes sense. So, okay, so I fully, I feel like I fully explored the facilities and the radio-ish area. I haven't explored the tower bit. Um. So let's just go that way, and let's avoid going up to where he said to go. <laughs> oh man, no, it won't let me move. It won't let me go. Oh, fudge. Do I still get to explore, Captain? This is my real sort of like concern. Because I haven't found all the letters yet. <laughs> I'm two away. Two away. 
Getting there. Yeah, not if the game doesn't let me find them all, though. Because that would suck. Okay, it's gone quiet, so there's no more letters in this area, but there might still be another rock. Story hooked you too hard. Okay, fair enough. I feel like you might get extra story, though, if you try real hard, though. Maybe. I don't know. Like, um, because there's definitely something extra to be said than the letters, no? Unless, kind of, like, towards the end you kind of reveal all the, the reason why you're, everything's so creepy and spoopy. Ah! The top of the hill. I hope this <laughs> it was like an ah. Uh. <laughs> uh, okay. We were due. It's been like a minute since the last one. It's been about half an hour. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Twenty-eight minutes is not one minute. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Yep, I am also hope that. I am also hope that. Yes. No spoilers, but I figured that that would be the case. Six, Captain. Replay in this value. Replay value in this game through the roof. I'm not sure I can handle going through all this. <laughs> this is it for you. <laughs> Do you just not want me to go up there? You don't want me to go. You want me to go inside this creepy fucking building, don't you? I hate this game. God, I accidentally clicked one of the articles on Kotaku that led to Jezebel. Jezebel? Uh, here's a sentence from <laughs> Oh no, what's, what's happening? Rin, he's... he had an accident. He... he died. Wait, you're still in the, the time thing. You might be able to stop this. No, no, come on. Clarissa was dead too, but like bunny ears dead, not dead dead, because... Apparently killing yourself doesn't actually do anything. Oh, do you have to say something like that? That's just tempting fate. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Should have been like really I nice. Didn't mean anything. What happened? He he drowned. He took a fall. Ah. Oh. I don't know. He just he just stopped. I mean, does it really matter what happened? La 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 la. Done is done. Whatever you want to call it, I know you're doing it. Just fix it. It's not us doing it, dear. We weren't lying. The time loops, as you've taken to calling them, which we do find so adorable, are of your. They get like proper vicious as they go along, yeah, aren't they? Sure. They started off like uh. That we have and will own up to. But the other stuff, that we're afraid is on you. Alex, we know you're in charge and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. What do you mean it never does? So we have a proposition for you. A deal. Oh, we've got a proposition. Really? And you should take it. It's already over with Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's Whoa. nothing you can do to change that. But if you agree to let us take her, let her go quietly without fuss, you won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Reginald here. We leave the rest of you cattle alone. No, no, no way. I'm saving everyone. Everyone is coming home with me. We're all getting out of here. <sighs> Courage is not always the way, dear. You don't have much time left. Do you know how we know you don't have much time left? We know because we can be Jonas, but this long, and his soul's as quiet as an empty church. Just never say we did intend to provide you all the rules. Oh dear. Oh 
Oh, fuck. Can I go up here now? Possibly, but no, we'll, we'll I can't. Do you need to save Ren? Like, he drops off the bridge, technically, but I don't know. Oh, there's a tape over there. I don't like this game, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I you like bits of this game. I like bits of it, yeah. Yeah, yeah, go. Let me get to the it's, tape player. I it's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here. This is. He was more important. It's not stupid. It's not small to like somebody. It doesn't. It doesn't diminish anything. Maybe. It's a tiny thing, but I hope he knew that I liked him. Uh, he knew. Well, if he did, he knew, no, no. Don't worry. He knew. Like I said. It's a tiny thing, but thanks, Alex. <sighs> oh, I didn't hear he said hoped. That would imply get together, get together. Yeah. The station's up at the top of the. Ugh. God, that was. My mouth feels like I just ate a tree. The ghosts, they tried to make like a deal with me for Clarissa's life. I didn't take it, of course, but I don't know. I, I just thought you should know. God, that must mean they're getting desperate or something. If they had any, like, power over the situation, they wouldn't try to work out a compromise. He's got a point. Anyway. Yeah, that's, that's so oh. logic. <clears throat> Anyone there? You always take the path of least resistance. If they had no they're, resistance, uh, somehow, then... I guess they're somehow broadcasting or something from the uh, station speakers. Mm. Are you guys at the station? You're both Anybody. alive. That's all Jonas? I have. God. Jonas? Yeah. Punch Alex if you can hear That's this. a bonus too. Punch Alex if you can hear this. You <laughs> dick. <laughs> right, that's right, you Jonas, dick. We're all set here for the, uh, the thing? The machinery speak and hug or whatever we're doing? Yeah, let's do it. Time's a wasted. Do I still get a chance to I explore, know, Captain, wasted. after this bit? Like, I feel my body wasted away. Or is it moving no, on? It's We had to deal with stuff. What stuff? The, uh, when I almost kind of slipped and fell off the bridge. Oh my god, you guys, that No, it was this. It was psychotic to watch. Uh, are you guys like, gonna keep chatting? Or can I find my anomaly? My it wasn't that. You were perilously close to tumbling into the ocean from like 5,000 feet up. It wasn't that high. It was like... It was high. Believe me. Well, how do you know no, it wasn't? Yeah, it was. I know who I am. No. no. It... Uh, just it's whatever. I'm fine. Mm. She is fine. It's what fine. are you playing at the Shut moment, up. Scott? Uh, I am okay, still playing just... Fire Emblem. The uh, Shadows oh, of Life. Right. Yeah. Um, Did you finish Persona? The receiver thing and we oh, yeah. Do this stuff. With, uh, exactly. just under... Just, exactly. just under 100 hours. Right. Hundred hours, or just over a hundred hours, possibly. Why do you have to have the last word? Over um, is good enough. It was very, very good, but uh, maybe not quite as good as Persona Four for me. Oh really? Uh, there was certainly. Uh, it's it's hard to get into too much detail about spoilers, but there's certain characters and situations I think, uh, and certain things about the tone and the way the game concluded that I prefer, I prefer the Persona Four. Uh, that said, there's some really excellent, excellent stuff in Persona 5. Uh, the, 
the sense of style is off the charts. It does look pretty swish. But yeah, Chicken um, never rocks. <laughs> Hello. We're here. Certainly didn't regret my 105 hours oh, hello. whatever it was. This is Edward Island's emergency. How may I help you? If you're being sat on by a very large burglar, just mash the dial with your fist, please. Otherwise, stay on the line, and we'll send a traffic custodian out to you directly. It is so nice to hear you two finding <laughs> the sunny side of all this. We are. I could have told him about the deal, we but I don't know. Don't let her fool you. Send the call then, I guess. All right, you gotta uh, put in the call. Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. Great. Okay, we'll meet you there. Okay. okay. See you at the shelter. Right, Where after I go now? exploring. Oh, okay, <laughs> right. Oh, um, you've only got one anomaly left. Oh, really? Um. Um. So one can you screenshot one... this for me, please? <laughs> I can, yeah. Um, so I can be sure, like, you know, bits that I have explored and bits that I haven't explored. I think the only remaining p places are, like, Harden Tower, Epiphany Field, and... We're at the relay point currently, aren't we? No, we're not. Yeah. We're at the bridge stand. No, we're at the bridge stand, yeah. Um, so I haven't done the relay point. I don't think I've finished the campgrounds. I dropped the, the a screenshot in Discord. Okay, thanks. I appreciate that. Um, so let's not go to Epiphany Field. Let's try and go back to the campgrounds. Epiphany Field, I try to lock you into story again. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. So let's not go to Epiphany Field. <laughs> Although, do I have to go to Epiphany Field to get to Harden Tower, though? I'm glad we've got someone who's uh, yeah, thank you. I played appreciate... this a little bit more. I'm glad that we've got someone here who has played this. Um, okay, so one more anomaly to find. How many more letters? Two more letters to find. Okay, so three collectibles left. Three collectibles left. Let's do it. You can get the ding ding mad chivos. I could go up and wind through Milner. Yeah, that's what the map looked like. So let's try that. Oh, I've, I've just grabbed that, so I don't need to do that. Let's go back the way that we came via the campgrounds. Let's finish exploring the campgrounds. And then we'll go from there, I guess. I couldn't I couldn't go anywhere else from here, could I? Like up. Let me look at the map again. <laughs> Alright, so your bridge stand. And you're trying to get to Milner. Um, no, I'm trying to go to the back to the um, campgrounds because I didn't finish exploring those before I got locked into going to the bridge stand. Oh, uh, it's just left, I think. Okay then. Um, let me see. So going right would that lead me directly to um, Epiphany? It leads to Towie Woods. And then Epiphany, yes. Okay, so let's not do that then. Let's go left. Yeah, let's go left and sit. So, do you think. How many areas are there? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So do you think it's roughly one letter per area then? Or is that a bit too yeah, It unique? seems to be about that, yeah. Come on, Jonas. Actually, I may have counted that wrong. It may be 12. Okay, then. I don't know what I'm going to play after this. Something happy. I have an idea, Mr. Jordan. Couldn't we have him reborn? Jonas! Okay, 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 I'm... Jesus Christ, I really hate that. But I'm... I think, um... Are you okay now, really? Yeah, I think. 
It's just, uh, uh... Look, it's scary, needless to say, when I, like, drown or whatever in my own body, and it's starting to feel like... Just, like, how do I say this? Cause... Okay, I have a time limit for rambling nonsense, so let's pick it up a bit. I just want to say... I just, I think it would have been cool us living together for, oh. for whatever, senior year. And I'm just glad I met you. That's oh. Right. I'm just glad we met. <laughs> I'm glad too, okay? So there, it's out in the open, we're both glad. Okay, good. So, that's it. And the now end. we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. Yeah, let's finish strong now. No half acidness at the end. I've done this already, haven't I? Yeah. Yes. Okay. <sighs> so what are you at replay point? No. Um, I'm at campgrounds, I think. But you you don't think there's one here then? Um, I've done. I've done this one. There were two. Yeah, there was at least two there. Yeah. Okay, there's no Adler clue, so I've got the letter from this area. Um. Taking a long way round, taking a long way round. Uh, relay point. Let's go to the relay point. Okay, it definitely comes in like chunks, doesn't it? You know, like the spoopiness. Yes, it's uh, you. You do get a breathing room. That's or nice. Some breathing room. Oh my god, Alex, climb up the dam. There we go. Um, I'm gonna go up. So um, I'm gonna close this now because it's depressing. But that Jezebel article accidentally opened. Uh, here's a sentence. Life is a painful and excruciating misery, made worse by the fact that we have a boundless capacity to put our feet into our own mouths. I'll close that tab. Why we? Why did you accidentally open a Jezebel article? Because it was linked on Kotaku. Oh, was it? What was it? In... Like, on the sidebar, like, uh, they've got a thing on the sidebar where it switches between three articles. Oh, okay. And I was trying to click something else. What was it related? What was the article that you were looking at? Uh, oh god, I can't remember now, it's just a game... Oh, I can't go this way. Oh yeah, I was trying to click Smash Pro's Tournament Victory Speech Calls Out Nintendo. <laughs> Did you find what you were looking for? <laughs> Did you get that hot, hot news? <laughs> I'm happy for you, but now we've got to nuke the VOD because you said the F word twice, said the host. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, let's go to the outpost. Let's go to the outpost. There's a very different article, says Captain. <laughs> yes. Just getting an insight into Scott's browser history. <laughs> um, okay, so let's go. Oh, I can't go in this door. Okay. Oh, we're going to end up going all the way back round, aren't we? Shite. <laughs> Never mind. Um, where are we going? Facilities. We've been to facilities. We've done facilities. So we don't need to go right back into the spoopy place, which is good because I didn't like that place. Because that was where the horrible stuff in the classroom happened. I did not like that bit. I'm trying to think of like what's been the worst bit so far. I think that bit in the classroom was one of the worst. The classroom, the house. Horrible. The classroom, the house. I think the classroom was worse than the house. Yeah. Almost. Because at that point, the ghosts didn't have like a voice. Yeah, by the time you got to the house, you. By the time you got to the house, the, the ghosts were. They actually had their own voice. You, were, you had a more way. identifiable. Yeah, more entity. identifable. Whereas, like, in the classroom, you didn't know what the hell you were dealing with. And they. Like, yeah. what's been really scary is that whole, like, piecing together and snippets of, like, other. Um, speech things that they use to talk that they have been using to talk that's been like really difficult to listen to it's scary um where does this go oh i don't want to do that 
Can it, does it look like it can go round by a Milner? Let me bring the map back up. Um, Clarissa falling out the window really did. Oh yeah, that was awful. I think that was the beginning of <laughs> the horribleness. Okay, so you're at Fort Milner right now. Um, I'm at the outpost. You're at the outpost specifically. Where are you trying to go? Um, I'm trying to go to to Wee Woods, maybe. No, wait. Hold on a second. Um, the Harden Tower is where I want to go. Harden Tower is left if there is a path to it, left and down. Left takes me to Epiphany Fields. Yeah, Harden Tower is above Epiphany Fields. What's all the rest? The what's else is to the right? There's the there's the outpost. There's the Minor communication outpost. school. There is the U.S. Army. RCS and there is facilities as described as. Okay, which we've already done, so I don't really have any choice except um, I've, I've done the cliffs, so on the left hand side I've done the cliffs and I've done the main town and then I've done I've just done all the bit in the top left, haven't I? So it must be the woods. So it must be Where are the woods again, did you say? Uh, the woods are to the left of Epiphany Field so this was the problem. This is why you kind of had to go all the way around. Can I get to the woods by via the campgrounds or anything? Yes, you can get to the woods by going right from where we started this process. Oh crap! <laughs> yeah. Do you think that's worth doing? It's worth trying at least, isn't it? It will. I mean, if you keep going right uh, from the beginning, like once you get back to the bridge stand slash camp woods. Um, if you once you pass through Towie Woods or whatever, you pass, you, you end up in Epiphany Field anyway. Okay then, so I might as well try it. Yeah, I might as well try it because I know that this way definitely leads to Epiphany Fields, and I don't want to do that yet. So we'll try the other way, and if I end up at Epiphany Fields, then I end up at Epiphany Fields, and then so so be it. No more Adler clues here, though. So I reckon the last one's probably in ta in the tower. So that takes me to relay point. Um, and in terms of like you know story, the the real the gut punchy moments have been. Um, the um, the bit on the beach, the go back in time. So yeah, probably. Yes, everything relating to like, cause they're all having set like melancholy stories about it all throughout the all throughout the game. It's a very bittersweet tone. Am I going the right way? Shit, I can't remember. Susan wanders around for half of the stream. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, Alex, just move! Okay, so here's a signpost. That takes me to the campgrounds. Where can I go from the campgrounds? Uh, if you go right from the campgrounds, you're supposed to end up in the woods, unless these are the woods. No. Because this is that's the relay point that we've just been at, right? Oh, right, so it's down and right. Yeah, yeah. so if you go down and then sort of yeah, right, so... you'll end up. Okay then, let's do that then. Down and right. And then just keep going right. I'm sure that would be enough. Okay then. Oh, that takes you to the bridge stand. That bit, half there. Oh no, who knows, let's just keep going. Damn it, Alex, climb the wall. <laughs> We've gone back in 10, 20 like, minutes. <laughs> yeah, it's like legit getting stuck on a wall. It just seems like such a shame to not do the last anomaly, you know? I'll be very annoyed. Yeah, but then at the same time, I'm like, should I just leave it? Do I care then off? But we've come this far. I know, right? And you know what? I'm not beyond using a guide. <laughs> well, we're we're not well, we're not using a guide. I mean, 
Which is like really logic for much... flowing through each of them. There's not really yeah, much there's to Yeah, there's not really it, much so. to guide beyond us aiming for a specific set of circumstances. I just worry that um, there's uh, that I've missed something, that like there's something that's really difficult to see that I haven't seen, you know? Yeah. Oh, this just takes me back to the bridge stand, doesn't it? Yes, but if you do that, let me look at the map again. I'm pretty sure right at the bridge stand. This is a terrible map. <laughs> yes, right at the bridge stand leads to Towie Woods. Okay then. And Towie Woods is the one that we hope there's an anomaly in. Towie Woods. Yes, it's it's. Uh, the only way is eternal suffering. <laughs> Very that's, good. That's what that show is about, right? <laughs> yeah. Um. I think I got the letter that was here, but because it was by the graves, wasn't it? Yeah. I hope I can save Clarissa. You know. Um, I'm just going to check up here one more time because I'm super paranoid. <laughs> I did that one, didn't I? I mean, if I didn't do that one, I'd be very angry with myself. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't feel like there's very much more left to explore, really, is there? Unless one of the anomalies is in, like, you know, the next area to unlock. But I feel like this is end game now, you know? Yep, yep. Okay, so we definitely explored this area. Sorry, everyone, took you on like a so, 20 minute detour. So down and to the right. Down and right. Down and right. That isn't a stone at the end there. Oh, no, it is. No, so we've, got we've it. done that. Down and right. Down. Wait, upright or down right? Uh, I guess we should check the same. Ah, two E woods. Nice. Let's go to the woods. Let's go to the woods. And this is why I have like three bottles of water blowing my desk. Ah. Okay, I don't remember looking around here. Is that a stone down there to the right? I think we've been, we've we've seen that one, haven't we? Okay. I'll, I'll go. I'll go and look anyway because you know you might as well if you're here. A fallen tango, Romeo, Echo, Echo. Now called something else. Okay, a fallen tree now called something else. But first of all, let's go see this anomaly. Let's double check that we got that one. Do, 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 do. Yep, definitely got that one. Oops. A fallen tree now called something else. Maybe that's referring to that little diagonal bit down there. You're right, Scott, you're reading about more dead celebrities. I hope not. <laughs> uh, no, I'm not. Um, I'll close that tab. All those. Everyone's depressed. Everyone's depressed. It's just a place. A fallen. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, I'm just tired. Uh, yeah, no, uh, that's okay. It's been a long couple of weeks, and next week in particular is going to be pretty bad. So. Edinburgh tomorrow. I think this, um, uh, Edinburgh Saturday. Sunfermline like Monday. Oh yeah, of course. Something. Um. So 
Well, I'm in Edinburgh next uh, week as well. Yeah. It's not exactly of course, E3 next week as well. Think oh yeah, E3, E3, here. God, it comes around so quickly, doesn't it? Basically Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, or the main days. Nothing here? No, not done this bit, so I'm going to go down that cliff on the left. Um, I can't see any rocks, squints. Um, yeah, it's almost like, you know, the um, the thought Isn't... of next week being a nightmare week is making me feel tired. <laughs> yes, absolutely. No, that's, that's a, uh, like, there was nothing on like, that yeah, stump, by the way. To... No, no. Okay. Um, it's, uh, a... yeah, no, it's the mental. Yeah. And then, like, when it's when you're actually in it, it's, probably, it's, not, it's that not actually bad, really though. that bad, but it's like the gearing up to it. It's like really yeah. exhausting. Come on, rocks. Aha! I guess Maggie was Yay! There. So all we're missing is Don't! one letter. <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> one letter. Um, okay. Well, let's check um, for anomalies. Just in case. I honestly think it's in a tower, though, at this point, isn't it? Um... Have you been back to the tower since this such the situation started? No, because um, uh, shit went gonna... down, didn't it? And then it yeah. just. You think Epiphany Fields just gonna trigger all that? I think it probably will do, but either way, Epiphany Fields is the only way that I can get to the tower, isn't it? So. Yeah. Maybe like I can get to Epiphany Fields and then not like go in the bunker. <laughs> yep. Um, fingers crossed. But if, but if this stuff isn't in the tower, then I don't know where it is. I really hope I haven't missed anything. I'll be very annoyed if I have. But you know, at one po at some point you have to call it, don't you? Never. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. Never give up. <laughs> You'll never take me alive. <laughs> Keep up, Jonas. Keep up. I really do like how this game looks though, I must say. Yes, it's very pretty. It is very pretty. But um Oh my god, play next after this. I've been playing Old Man's Journey by the way, except I got stuck on a puzzle. <laughs> I'm stuck on a puzzle, it's really annoying. No, you are the old man. No, I am the old man, yeah. <laughs> oh dear. 5 a.m. Yep, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna say one thing, and then I promise it'll be the last time I bring it up tonight. But okay. you know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? I mean, it's not a giant thing, but still. Huh? I didn't screw uh -oh. up. How was I supposed to know her mom was gonna call in the car stolen? I thought she uh had permission. Give me a break. Even if you didn't know, which come on, even if you didn't know that, you still knew you didn't have permission to go to the concert. <sighs> just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However, inadvertently. It'll be the last time, but maybe not for the reasons you think. No, my heart. I don't really care about the reasons, just for my own sanity. Don't do it anymore. Oh, and I wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna really, um, like, commit to Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something. Wow. Big man on campus. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> Big step That's on campus. Big step. <laughs> eh, it's not a big deal. I'm just letting you know, so... I don't know. I don't know why. I just wanted to tell you. Come on, let's get to the sentry before the last boat comes. I gotta get the uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. What history project? They still make you do, like, work with so little left in the year? Unfortunately. This is... It's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kind of... I don't know. And I mean... It's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. Same people, the same expressions. Well, if you leave, I'd certainly miss you. Yeah, no, I'd miss you too. It's just that everybody here knows me, you know? 
I know you think I have it on Easy Street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? Give me a rest. You were... are great, though. And... and you're gonna be great whatever you do. I'm sure of it. You got spunk, kid. Yeah, well... <laughs> Uh, let's head back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. You know what he said? Oh, God, Michael, I have no idea. I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. Oh, she's getting a bit was, real, Scott. I, I don't like know, it. for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is... GTA Alex. <laughs> Alex? You got, you know, you went bad again? I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done, now. I saw, I saw Michael again. I just, I'm sorry. When I'm there, I just get sucked into it like nothing happened. Come on, it's all right. I think I can hear Ren and Nona down there. Are they next to the last letter? No, no. Oh, there's no. There's no clue. There's no clue, no. Oh, well, I can go left to the tower, maybe. Okay. Damn it! <laughs> right, well, let's look around here, see if at the very least I've missed any rocks. I, it won't let me go this way either. No, all paths are blocked. I want to go to that tower, damn it! <laughs> Keep an eye out for any rocks. Okay, it's gonna get spoopy. Ah, is that a rock? Just don't say anything to them, okay? This say it? anything about what? Oh, what I've are seen you guys that one talking already. about? We're dating. We're dating. Nona and I. We're gonna date. Well done, dude. What did I just say? What they asked, right? You asked. Mom Yay! The happy couple. <laughs> Thank you. Aww. No, stop. It's one date at the revival theater. She's like, steady on, lad. Sit quietly in the dark and watch a documentary on Bosnian genocide. On Bosnian genocide. Romantic. Aww, cute. Riviera is a great movie house. <laughs> Oh my. Please don't tell him that. Anyways, <laughs> I know it's stupid to be planning or whatever for this, but I don't know. I just feel like maybe it's not that insignificant or whatever. Whatever. Truly the language of love. Good. I'm glad. This is... I mean, at the very least, I'll get to hear embarrassing stories, so... I... I want to get this off my chest. Just... Something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something broke. I don't know if it was the ghosts or whatever, but... You've been acting like not you. Ren. No, I just, I don't Well, know. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't know what else to say, really. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm even saying this now. This is stupid, but can we like, picture? Take a picture? <laughs> I don't know. In case things go bad and yeah, let's do it. We're on a beach, kind of. Let's keep a shred of normal here. All right, let's take it. Alex, get in here. Oh, oh, there's gonna be creepy stuff. You're not getting out of it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So. Oh, there we go. Sure it's the end game. Right, so that's your end game. That's my end game. Right, Susan runs away, running away, running. Oh, nope,s running away, running away. <laughs> 
Are you running to the tower? I'm running to the tower. Yes, yeah, the last place I've checked. I haven't checked. I, I no, hey, I'm, I'm, I'm not arguing. That sounds like where I would go. Although, actually, I can't remember if I've checked this place or not. Have I checked Fort Milner? Was Fort I think Milner? we were there earlier. Oh, what's it? What's it? Oh. Oh, that's nice. Look at his grumpy face, though, guy in the foreground. Jonas. That's his name. Oh, you got me together with someone. Oh, <laughs> my life is so difficult. Oh, okay, so this is Milner Outpost. We've been there, done that. Um, so let's go to Harden Tower. And then let's pray to all of our gods that we've... Um, let's pray to all our video game gods that we've found the, all the stuff. Because if not... Well, I don't know. Maybe there are consequences. I love how Jonas is still coming with me, though. <laughs> yeah, pray to our own Jesus. <laughs> right, let's keep an eye out. Oh, wait, first of all. Memories would Aha! Without this, Papa, Lima, Alpha, Quebec, Uniform, Echo. Okay, memories would fade without this plaque. Stone, stone, stones. Can I see some stones? Stone, stone, stones. I want to see some stones. Aha! Oh, she was working at the tower the morning they saw. Right. Got the letters. Got them. Let's read them. There's, uh, oops. There's a similar statue of a soldier in Maine where I grew up. My memory of it is, I think, part of the reason why I said yes when the army recruited me out of college, despite my family's protestations. Anna, my closest friend from childhood, was, of course, thrilled at the possibility of my escape. I normally, I, I. Pfft. I anonymously started the petition in 1975 to have this one made after the daughter of Canaloa crewman Francis Salter asked. I don't know why a marker may be for the hope I once had to help people. Oh dear. Recruits like are we, Do we know that these are in order? Good lord, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay. Recruits learned communications technology here, and several others learned code breaking, it's true, but due to my aptitude in math and mechanical engineering, I was assigned code making, specifically ciphers, with which to conceal projects from even other government agencies. It was a job I grew increasingly uncomfortable with. My keen interest in radio science had me pulling double duty as a comms officer. I remember one of the Canaloa's engineers, Francis, calling me a radio woman. As far as he knew, it was my only job. I was on watch duty in the tower when it happened, having just gotten back from an early leave from the reading of my father's will. For years I childishly blamed him for this too, his one last act against me, but it was nobody's fault or decision but my own. I'm sure it was Francis Salter who sent the Canaloa's distress signal, it had been cut off, I still don't know why. And I hastily interpreted the garbled transmission as an attempt to jam radar. Oh. So I sent back the guidebook recommendation to scout and bomb if necessary. Oh, man. The USS Walter Roy, a destroyer escort, sunk the USS Canaloa with friendly fire. Oh, shit. On October 25th, 1943, it had held a developmental nuclear reactor in its belly. It had been sent out weeks earlier as a test of its capabilities. Relatively few even knew of its existence, which tripled the base's confusion when the submarine's communications had been cut. No one outside of a handful of us would ever know the truth. I would discover later a weapons technician of the Walter Roy had been at Francis Salter's wedding. Salter was an engineer in the Canaloa. I don't know why, but it's strange to me. The first transmission from the lost soldiers were recorded here by a signal officer training new recruits. I heard about it soon after. Yes, word of the childlike, almost playful messages spread quickly, but the broadcasts were usually dis dismissed as an ongoing prank, faulty equipment or AM stations bouncing off the Midland. However, after I successfully decoded one as a mayday from Calvin Gilbert, an electrician who perished on the USS Canaloa, I knew it had to be something more. Whoa! Oh no! Marianne Bozek, forever engraved on the Command Annex's memorial plaque, was a kind, humble woman who helped me decode the ghost's unusual messages. I don't think she ever really believed my hypothesis that they were relays from the sunken submarine, even though she corresponded with, as she put it, a man named Calvin, an electrician who died on the Canaloa. I pieced together the truth, the cover-up, and my own tragic mistake that killed him and his mates over months of careful deciphering. When people in the comms department began transferring, began transferring off, I was able to convince my higher-ups, including, coincidentally, one eventual army passenger on board the Canaloa, Henry Griffin, to bring Anna on board as a replacement. Anna had been working in broadcasting, so it made enough sense for that upper ranks, and incidentally, when I dream, it's usually during this time period amidst the change, and I am trying to prevent Anna from ever coming. 
Ooh. Dream. <sighs> my belief, bolstered by Anna's and my research, conducted largely at the Catbird Station where interruptions were rare, is that the men and the women of USS Canelo were separated from our dimensional existence by the implosion of the submarine's nuclear reactor. Uh... I identified one passenger, Henry, by his call sign, and his confused diction and reliance on game logic says to me that their emotional states, if not mental states, have been reduced to that of children, a thought I cling to when I envision Anna's demise. Anna and I frequently conducted tests at what was once the East Barracks here during the brutal winter of 51. Waves of any kind, radio, nuclear, electromagnetic, seemed able to pass through all existences under certain circumstances, which explained our ability to get communiques sent from them. This might also justify the frequency of hearing one of the Canelo's electricians' call signs, Calvin Gilbert, come echoing through the relays. On April 4th, 1952, we would attempt to reverse the manifest breakdown and bring the soldiers back. This ends well, doesn't it? <laughs> After stealing equipment from the relay station, Anna and I entered the cave just before dawn to try and communicate directly with the crew of the USS Canaloa. We successfully tuned into the source of temporal tear and spoke, albeit briefly, to Henry Griffin, an SOC sergeant who died in the sub, but the power overwhelmed my dear Anna, and she was absorbed into its ridge. All that remains there now is a flickering hue of a partially open gate, a window to a perpendicular space seems to have augmented the submarine's call. But, of all my regrets, perhaps the deepest is knowing Anna's last vision was of me fleeing from her in terror. Oh, fuck. After the fort closed, I used the considerable resources from my father's endowment to buy up most of the land or influence government officials to declare that which I could not buy protected. I have not been entirely successful and watched in horror as a small tourist industry has precariously sprung upon this cursed island. Even the family of one of the sailors who died, Calvin Gilbert, set up a restaurant to cater to inquisitive out-of-towners. I can promise this, though. The museum will never happen. The beach and caves will be boarded up. So whoever is finding these notes, understand my hope is that by enshrouding this intelligence in such an obtuse manner, its detection will discourage most innocent seekers, thereby allowing it to befall the correct person, and not the easily distracted military mind, nor the typically bewildered excursionist. Do not blame the submarine's crew. I don't believe its passengers like Henry Griffin can even understand what has truly happened to them, and you do not have to forgive me for my myriad failures, but please remember the name Anna Shea. Know that she did not deserve her fate. To whom it should concern, this island and this island is a lie. I have been compelled by both forces outside of my control, my own willful concern for the safety of others, to conceal the many truths about Edward's Island, but now I feel any further inaction may carry a far greater risk. Etc. etc. But also know that I exacted in what I felt were the best interests for all at time and truly for the interest of time itself, Margaret Adler. So she pretty much knows what happened. <sighs> Well, this Although is it doesn't, sound like she, it doesn't sound like she's had as much interaction with the ghosts themselves as no. you have. Yeah. And also, they're less childlike in talking to you. I think um, probably so. The the temporal tear thing that opened up in the caves, maybe mm -hmm. like by tuning into it, we made it worse and made it like open up. Maybe right. that's why the ghosts are kind of like, well, you know, it's all your fault, really. Um, why they're able to come through like a little bit more. Yeah. Probably open the door. Uh, I don't think we're going to find that last anomaly. I'm really tempted to look at a guide. <laughs> uh, maybe let me have a little read. Okay. There's one behind the locked door in the facilities. Um, which we did, I think. There's one at the campgrounds. Um, pretty sure we did that one. Looking at the pictures here, the yeah, I think we did, yeah. Uh, U.S. Army uh, Rex. Campgrounds one, yep. Grave one, yep. Discovery Cliffs, yep. Bridge Stand, yep. Biffany Fields, near the bomb shelter. Uh, that was an anomaly, the one... The thing at the corner. Yeah, it's like on the corner of like a... 
point in the path, isn't it? Yeah, and you did get that one, though. Yeah, I did get that one. Okay. Oh, yeah, because you did it during the conversation. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, the one at Terry Woods, yep. The one at Mil Milner Outpost. Yep, looking at the placards there. Uh, Epiphany Fields, so sort of one just on the path that's kind of hard to miss, uh, easy to miss. Okay, um, let's have a look see. Alright, so the, the, yeah, and there might be one, in, you might have missed the one at Relay Point, but I think it's the one on Epiphany Fields we've missed. Okay, so whereabouts so in Epiphany Fields? You're kind of looking for a flat plane. I think it's at the bottom. Okay, we're at Epiphany Fields, so let's do this. Not by the statue. No. No. Further down, maybe. Further down. Further down. Uh, hilariously, I managed to pause the stream like 20 minutes ago as you were passing it, I think. Really? <laughs> I'm looking at the picture of where you were when I paused the stream and it's pretty close. I think it's to the left of here. Oh, let's have a look. It's like around here somewhere. Squints. No, I found that one. Is that the one? Hang on. Um... <laughs> I hate that right. it doesn't tell you, like, if you found them all or not. Uh, what's near to you right now? Let's look at the map. Oops. Um, opening Twitter again. Uh... So, to so the left is Discovery Cliffs. Well, yeah, left and down, yeah. I'm not um, usually... I'm not... I'm not above using a guide or anything. No, no, we don't care at this point. I really don't care at this point. <laughs> uh, With one Discovery, left to there go. Is, there is one in Discovery Cliffs, but I feel like you would have got it, but maybe you missed it. Um, uh, the one in Discovery Cliffs is inside a building. Um, I've, I did that before I came onto the stream. Yeah, I think I feel like you got that one. Let me see. So oxen free. Um... I can link you the guide if you want. Um, yeah, if you could, I'll check it on my phone. It's just a bunch of YouTube videos, but you can tell from the picture of, of where the YouTube video was paused. You, you'll see what where each anomaly is. Yeah, like there's one in that shack. Oh yeah, I've I've done this one. Yeah. Oops, telephone. So in the facilities in the locked office, I've done that. Northwest corner of the campgrounds, done that. Next to the sign, done that. Northeast Trail, done that. Under the bridge, done that. Area, done that. Bridge stand area, done that. Done that one. Done that one. Near the fire, done that. Done that. To the west of this wishing well. Near the small stoop in the relay point area. Yeah, I think the relay point one is the one that I've missed. Because the others look familiar. Yeah, the others all look familiar, so... So, let's try relay point. How the hell do I get to relay point? <laughs> oh, how do I get to relay point? I've forgotten everything I know. Is 
There is also um, a secret phone number you can call. Yes, I am. I was doing some googling, and I saw all of that nut stuff about like the real life. Um, yeah. Game, which just creeps me the fuck out. Like, no way. It's bad enough it being contained within the game. Never mind, like, kind of like connecting it to real life. That's too much, man. Um, too much for me, anyway. Too spooky for me. Maximum spoop. Yeah, maximum spoop. Oh man, all the way back to this fucking relay point. So anyway, what have you got lined up for tomorrow? Uh, I've got to go to Edinburgh. Oh yeah, of course. You just said that earlier, sorry. It's okay, no, it's, it's a valid question. I'm um, hoping the one, like, I'll, obviously I care about what I'm doing there, but the one, like, super positive thing, I hope, um, for me, it's selfish, but is that uh, I'm hoping we go to the Red Box for lunch, which is a little place where you can get little noodle boxes. <laughs> oh, tell me more about these noodle boxes. So you can pick from uh, your five different like noodle styles. So you get like a ramen, rice noodle, udon, uh, egg, and something else that I've forgotten. Uh, and then you like you pick your veg, you pick your meats, and you pick any extras, and then they put it in a wee box. And it's like it's like five fifty, which is quite good for Edinburgh. Do you like um, um, Korean bibimbap at all? I don't know. It's like rice bowl with like loads of different stuff on it. That sounds good. Because <laughs> um, there's a place um, well, called, funnily enough, bibimbap here in London that um, works on a similar principle. It's kind of like you know the base is always the same, but you just add the old bits and pieces to it. Yeah. And it's really good. It's always like really packed in there though. The Bimbap so so Yeah, that's the one. And it's only open at like specific times during the day. They open like for lunch and then they open for dinner. So you can't like just rock up and, <laughs> and it looks get it good. at any time. It is really nice in there. It's really I mean nice. I had uh, I had Korean when I was Texas of all places. <laughs> uh, uh, this little Korean place that uh, my friend Devo used to take me to. Uh, uh, we went like twice and it was really good. Uh, what was that called? It was a specific dish, it was like beef. Um, bulgogi? Bulgogi, that's it! Oh, it was lovely. Oh yeah, no, it's really good. Bulgogi beef is so good. So, yeah, so it was good. Really nice. Like the juices from the meat were mm. just like flavouring the rice all the mm. way through. And, oh, it was, Juicy rice is always the best. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Welcome uh, to the ready upstream where we make everybody hungry. <laughs> I've already had dinner. I'm making myself hungry again. I know. I've been the same. I've had dinner as well. But I'm, I'm kind of hungry now. Wait, where am I going? I've forgotten where I'm going. All right, relay point. This is not relay point, is it? This is bridge stand. This is bridge stand. So relay, relay point, point is, is to the north. Up, isn't it? Yeah, that was it. Oh yeah, because it was like, oh, the relay points at the top of this, thing. and I was like, oh no. Um, you got that one, obviously. I got this one, yeah. So where's the other one? <laughs> you just ate, Captain. I'm glad you just ate too. Tell me about what you ate. <laughs> I thought that was Rolo there, because we also have a Captain Rolo. Oh, Commander. He's a Commander, not Captain. Oh, he's Commander. Yeah, you're right. That's true. Um, <laughs> he's just kinda... going, yep, <laughs> to me. Where the, where Let me the correct fudges? that title. Yeah. Uh, Susan, look on the screen right now. Yes. Do you see that rock in the bottom left there? Is that a rock? That blue thing. That blue thing. Maybe. I'm not sure. No, it's not no, even that anyway. <laughs> that's just a thing. So the Western Wishing Well near the small stoop in the relay point area. Okay, so we're definitely in the right area. We just need to go a bit south, I guess. Yeah. To the left. Going south, going south. It must be like way past 6 a.m. now. <laughs> just spent all this game time just over. like. Yeah, game over. You took too long. <laughs> the ghost's got bored. 
god. Oh god. <laughs> like legit ghosts. What did you have for dinner, Scott? Uh, it was a very late dinner because we had a. Uh, because uh, I had a fit of roll in the town when I was shopping for mum. Fair enough. Or, or I picked it up and then I, I wait for it to get slightly cool because when you get it from the shop, it's uh, from the chippy, it's boiling hot and I don't like that melting into my gums. So I wait until I get home and it's cooled down a bit. Also, the salt and vinegar kind of soaks into it. And I'm not, I'm usually not the kind of guy who puts a lot of salt and vinegar on their chips in the chippy, but I like that sort of soaking in. I feel like it has to be the left there, but maybe I'm wrong. Yeah. Oh, look at that screenshot again. I can't see a fudge kicking thing on that screenshot. <laughs> okay, right. Let's just. Um... Uh, but so yeah, I just had a, I just had a sandwich and some stuff, uh, some tiger bread. Nice. Uh, Captain says we call it a Californian burrito. It had asada, fries, sour cream, and guacamole. I like one thing there. Uh, it's not that one. It's we know it's not one. that one. Do, do you see? I don't even see where that corresponds to in the um, yeah in this area, unless I'm not in the right area. But I thought this was a relay point. I thought it was as well, but maybe it's not. Maybe it's check the sign. Check this the signs. Yeah, because that really leads to bridge stand. This should be unless a relay it, point. Unless it's that. Oh, no, it's not that tree there. Okay, never mind. Yeah, no, I was going to say, like, a, I, I really cannot even see where that would correspond, like, yeah. in this area. Maybe they're lying to me when you say, like, campground. Because that's really going to bother me if I don't find that, like, anomaly. That doesn't look like the relay book, because it was the bit with the wishing well, right? Yeah, I think so. Hmm. Anomaly 106.7 That's not how you spell anomaly Anomaly 106.7 Now this is just shameless at this point but <laughs> like I Captain suggests you might have to go left to the campground then up and then right to that entrance to the replay point Yeah, yeah Give it a go Yeah Let's give it a go Get on the damn thing! There we go. <laughs> I don't know what sound it's making, so I'm just imagining. Uh, it's like little clicking sounds. Like of little gears. Am I doing this overnight too? So I did my first playthrough. Um, not like overnight. I've done, this is my third session. I've been playing it for the past couple of weeks. Yeah, we've been doing it. Yeah, yeah. Um, we stream every 8pm BST on Monday. I, usually. yeah, well, I do anyway. <laughs> uh, it's it's my does. slot. This is my slot. And then um, on Friday, we, at 8pm BST, we do Casual Friday, which is our sort of multiplayer stream. Uh, but yeah, over the last couple of weeks, we thought we, we thought this might be a sort of chill ish come down from <laughs> XCOM 2, but apparently it wasn't. Turned out to be like way more stressful than. <laughs> Um, although XCOM 2 is really stressful. In a different way. In a different way, yeah. I just like, because I don't really, um, I, I, I don't handle scary games very well. Yeah. Um, okay, I can't go that way. I don't handle scary games very well, so it's kind of a um, marvel that I've even made it through with this one, to be honest. You know, like when I started this, I had such visions, like, you know, oh, I'll play this, and then after this, I'll play something else, like, scary, you know? Nope. Like, um, yeah, like, That's Soma or year. something. And I'm like, no, nah, yeah, basically. I've <laughs> You've used your allotment up. Yeah, fulfilled my quota. Did you do this in one sitting, Captain? You probably could do this in one sitting. You probably could, yeah. I mean, it's yeah, not, it's it's not exactly, thing. like, long. It's like, three, like, I've just been taking a very long time about it. It's maximum of like five hours. Over okay, there, over there. Oh! Yeah. That tree over there. Wait, which there's, tree? There's down. Like a... Down? Up or down? Uh, no, I can only go down. Yes. Oh, okay, okay. Oh. Is that... Ah! Is this it? Yeah! 
Yes! Achievement unlocked. Ghost stories. Yay! Did you get an achievement for the letters as well? Yeah. Oh, okay, we're done. Alright, end game. Um, that's what I thought he started at midnight plan just made an hour, but hope to finish around 5 30 and sat in bed trying to figure out what just experienced. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. It's pretty deep. Um yeah, no, it's one of those it's one of those things, like I can imagine that like when you get to the end you can there's gonna be like a lot of working out to do, you know? And what could I yep. have done better, what could have happened differently, is Clarissa still alive? <laughs> Not a hundred percent sure at this point. <laughs> she may be dead, and we may have killed her. So, hopefully, she's okay. Um, I would like to get everybody out alive and have the good ending if possible. But we shall see. We shall see. I mean, I'll be pissed if I don't have like at least a decent ending. After. How can you make the decent ending? Here I come. I You've not been know. actively antagonistic towards your friends. No. No, that's true. I've been nice to everybody. Wait, if you're mean to people, does that mean you get a bad end? Not necessarily. Hmm. Yeah, I was gonna think. Like, I could understand, I feel, like, why that would like, mean... I feel like that would just put them off of you. I can understand why that why like being mean would give you a bad end where clarissa dies for example yeah um all the endings are subjectively decent have you played through all of the endings captain is that why it took you like five hours to play through <laughs> going through all the endings um no the, the, the game is about three to six hours long isn't it yeah that was because at the end of this stream it will have been about six hours i've been playing this End game, end game, end game. No, just a couple. Okay, fair enough. Were you pleased with the endings that you got then? Do you think like you'd replay and try and get them all or something? Okay, end game. Hold on to your butts. Why are my streams always end up being hold on to your butts? <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. I brought the little one out with me today. Not the big one. 6 a.m. Oh, shit, and real. I don't want to say anything to Ren or Nona, but the truth of it is, I'm not feeling too awesome right now. It's oh. It's getting worse. Just hang in there, Jonas, okay? I know you feel like a garbage snowman right now, but we're almost done. Hey, what do you call a man who's short of time? Huh? Have you... No clue. Tim. You call him Tim. Oh, don't make that face. Why are you making that face at me? Oh. Uh, uh, Stop it! it. <laughs> Rolo's being a dick. He's, he's making like a... You scream. missed an amazing pun there. I know, Tim. Time. Yeah, no. Stop it. I will throw this stitch at you. <laughs> oh no. Here we go. Here we go. Stop it! Not in a time loop, right? Yeah, kind of does. I'm gonna have all the stitches. All the stitches. All right, you've got more stitches. More okay. stitches. Small stitches. Stitch up on stitch. It's fine. It's fine. This is all fine. I can't reach my keyboard. This is all fine. You guys. And the frog behind me, such a frog behind me. Stop. Kind of spooky, right? The beds? Thinking they would have slept here while the rest of us burned? Yeah, but do you think it would even have worked? Like if if Yugoslavia or whoever dropped an A-bomb on their heads. Who knows? Yeah, maybe not. It's kinda sad to think about. Oh, here goes. Wait, it's oh, damn, it's another radio wave log thing. Why? Why would you do this? Why? <laughs> Stop it. What is happening? 
<laughs> we have this um, chest burster plushy thing. That's oh like a God, big yeah, right, thing, and it's like you know, wrapped around the um, bedpost. You can tell which side of the bed is mine and which side of the bed is his. Oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Something happens on the other side of this door, just don't oh my god, the build up cut and run. Okay, if I turn into dead weight or start freaking out, just get to the boat, do whatever you have to. Jonas, we are all getting out of here. I mean, look, we're about to fix this in two minutes. Two minutes. This is microwave popcorn of a problem. I'm not asking, I'm telling. Look, dream a little dream, buddy. It's not gonna happen. I'm not gonna leave you now. Let's just get this door open, do what we gotta, and get home. Wait, oh no, wait, fuck wait, off. Okay, you know what? There's <laughs> the tenth time we've heard this song all night. There is something going on with Drake, go over there, Jonas! Like, why would this specific tune be all over the place? I have to know what's going on before we head in there. I'm sorry. Oh my god, and this is the demise. It's like breaking or something. Can you can you fix it? I mean, it's just so crazy to keep hearing this. It sounds like it's her, like a recording, or it's just, it's my mom. That's her voice in the static. You can hear that, right? I mean, I know you don't know what she sounded like, but you can hear that, the voice, right? Jonas, this, it doesn't feel right. Something's wrong. Wait, wait, wait. Is it possible? Do you, th do you think it's possible? I mean, we've been, like, talking with ghosts the entire night. Oh, no. Night. Scott! Do you think it's... <laughs> right? It's just, w with everything that's happened, she could have come here. I... Jonas, I'm sorry, but I, I really don't think that's her. Like, really her. Well, how would you know? And I mean, you don't know that for sure. I'm not saying I know that for sure, but from the stuff we've seen tonight, it just... This has to be possible. Oh no, the mirror! She's so close, you can just... Can you Scott, just do you remember what the, um, the thing said in the mirror? Isn't even, no clue what's going on, but... If you could just help me with this right now. Jonas, I know this is tough to understand but we really should be using the radio to get out of here and like that's it we have to leave we don't have to leave you just want to leave come on i'm sorry but please can you try and understand what's happening here why just, no don't don't do this i just can't just can't really get this to change or uh, mom can you uh, The music slowing down and breaking up. I really don't like this. Oh no, the music's still staying the same. Oh dear. I don't. I don't know what to do. Into a cave. <laughs> okay, nearly there, nearly there. Right before bedtime is over. <laughs> Sweet dreams. <laughs> of the cave and why use my friends what why are you switching with them why are you doing this 
Because it's scary, that's why. Have you ever stared into nothing and moved with it and felt a part in it? It's worse than when we were wilting into atoms. Worse than dying the first time. Whatever you think you can do, you can't. We're not going back. We won't go back. Child, wait your turn. Oh, the ghosts are arguing amongst themselves now. I don't know. Well, this is what started all this jazz. Can't hurt. Get it? Oh, I can move. Hello? Somebody there? Oh. Yes, no. Uh oh. Uh oh. Underwater. Under the sea. Just friendly crustaceans. <laughs> What? No way! I'm not. I'm not just gonna abandon Clarissa. Who do you think I am? Who do, who do you think we are? Do you think we wanted to be thrown away? Like some faulty appliance? We won't let it end like that. They didn't know it was you. Nobody, barely anybody, knew it wasn't just Maggie's fault or their fault. It. It was a catastrophic event. Who's that in the bottom right? Catastrophic events. You make it sound. Uh, Anna? I'm not sure. Like some faulty appliance? We won't let it end like that. There's... I know there's a crewman on that submarine named Francis. And to you, to all of you, I know it was fate, okay? Sometimes things go bad. You'll never change that. Francis. Oh was shit. Our name ever... Francis. I... almost remember. Come on, come on. You were, were people once. Don't lose that part of you to be this. It's... it's... Francis Salter. It's hard to remember certain things. Our faces went a while ago, then our names. Take notice of what you choose to. Oh. 
Did I do it? I ain't done it. Did I... Did it go okay? Is everything okay? Oh, wait, what? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good! <laughs> but heck, it's just... And you're Rolo again. Jonas! Jonas, where... Oh, no. Where I'm in the you? mirror. Okay. This is... This is gonna be fine. Just... Work through it. You should stay with Clarissa. Tell Michael to stay with Clarissa. They like each other a lot. But Michael's dead. How could I even... Whoa, wait. What? What's happening? Oh, I am the mirror. Yeah, you're you're now Whoa, doing all this you... stuff. Look, is someone there? So were those Kitty's choices then that I was picking over to? to and will somebody else tap into my choices? No, I think you're sorting out your choices right now. Should I let Jonas talk to his mom or do what you feel is best? When Jonas uh... gets in your, uh, case about his mom, just do what you feel is best, okay? His mom's dead. I know his mom's dead. W what is? So, if anybody else on my friends list plays this, will they pick up? Will they? Will I be their voice in the mirror then? I don't know. I feel like this is influencing you right now, but maybe I'm wrong. That could have gone better. Right. Time loop. I think... Hmm. Tell Michael I he think... should go out on his own. What does this... What does this matter? He's dead. He's not... He's not here. <sighs> I feel like I've made all the wrong choices. <laughs> not gonna say. Oh, I no. said something. <laughs> oh, God. I was just like, I can't remember what that bit was. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, this doesn't look promising, does it? Oh. oh, hey, I didn't even know you were home. You're always so quiet. It's like living with a little fairy tale mouse. Wait, I'm... Th this is our house. I'm not. I can't play Amnesia Spy Girl right now. Seriously, pretend to snap Ren's neck on your own time. I've been, like, struggling with this stupid speech, the graduation thing. I don't want it to be just the usual blah blah we've come so far type stuff. It should have like a point, right? It should bring you to your feet about something. Uh, sure, yeah. Give it a theme. I'm guessing mom probably told you about my scholarship to state, right? I don't really know how I feel about it. I mean, I feel it's not like it's a bad thing. It's a good thing, obviously. Well, uh, what are you thinking? Engineering? Oh, you said something about sports medicine one time. Yeah, I don't know about that anymore. It's just, you know, it seems like half the teachers are alumni and... Actually, I'm about to be really arrogant and presumptuous and say mean things for no real reason other than I think I know better, so forget it. I've bored you enough. I'm boring I'm me- I'm listening. Come on. I'm not gonna judge. No, no, really. I'm talking out of my ass. It's fine. No, let him talk. Yeah. Keep talking. The... <sighs> you can't tell mom or dad, but Clarissa and I are talking about just leaving. Getting an apartment somewhere and, and just doing our own thing. Wow, that's... That's exciting. This is like a huge deal, like like the boxcar children version of getting married or something. Uh, it's... yeah, it's kind of a big deal, I guess. It'll be a lot harder to break up, so there's some level of uh, vow there. She's been really pushing for it, wanting to look for places, and uh, I'm into the idea. I really am. I just... I wouldn't feel right about it if I didn't have your, like, blessing first. So, can you just wait I would say or something and say I'm alright to do this? To stay. I... Really? God, it's hard for me to say since mm -hmm. I love you, of course, but you should do it. Totally. Even if it explodes in a nuclear war style breakup, you'll regret never trying. Oh god, Alex. Thanks. That means a Did lot. Did you hear what she said there? Yeah. <laughs> Alex, just get good friends, okay? And when you're with those friends, just say yes to everything. And keep away from boys when you talk to them, it feels like you're performing. But also, stay away from girls who look you in the eye for too long. And match every beer with a water. And take classes outside of school. Classes you don't need. Um, okay. I'll make a, a checklist. This is just... Can you hear that, Scott? Case package, okay? 
That's no, the sound of my heart snapping into a million you, pieces. That's it. So. <laughs> oh. Quickly respond. I love you too. This game, man. Soon, I shall be so I cannot remember. Oh, I can hear Ren. But the things that never happened. Yeah, I, I don't know. Oh. Hey, she's waking up. Is she all right? Uh, ouch. Is um. Is everyone? <gasps> Did I get the good end? All right? Still, um, yourselves. Well, who's yeah, here? I think we're all accounted for, right? Yeah, for the most part. Yeah, my arm fell asleep. Jonas but... carried you here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. The the important thing is whatever you did in the cave, it worked. The tear. No, I'm gonna hole, sit down. I'm just gonna keep sitting down. <laughs> I'm not we're going yet. home. Or at least they've they've stopped trying to eat our souls. Yeah, it's important to note that. That's. I'm I'm glad. I'm sorry. I'm just. I was back. I fell back a few years during the whole thing, and I just saw Michael again. That's all. So. I'm just a little rattled right now. You saw Mike? What happened? What what was it like? Well, wait, yeah. I was, I think, well, I know I was back. Um, it was like a week before he drowned. We came here, actually. We hiked in the woods, just spent the day together, and I don't know. I was just there again. I'm sorry, Alex. Yeah, it's, I'm sure it was rough. No, it was, um, it was good to see him. It was good. He mm. looked good. He looked, um, himself. I had my older sister. It was a night where I don't even remember why she was mad at me. Probably something I said to our mom, but I don't know why that who cares night would visit. I wouldn't put much thought into it, Clarissa. Really. Yeah, it doesn't matter now. Maybe it's, I don't know, maybe it's like what matters to us showed up or something. The universe doesn't care about what matters to us. Then it doesn't matter anyway. No, I guess it doesn't. I can't oh, man. believe everything <laughs> I just... I feel like we should tell everyone we know. Like, go on a freaking book tour, but... I think we'd sound nuts, honestly. I, I mean, it's not like... It's not like we have What about your spoofy pictures? actually happened. Hey, is this your book? Oh, man. This is... We're gonna be the best couple ever. Oh my god. Uh, okay, slow down. I lost it on the way. I thought for sure some commuter would have just tossed it overboard. Hey, that reminds me. What were we... We were talking about something stupid right before Alex woke up. Prom? Uh, uh, prom. 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 <laughs> I am definitely skipping this one. I'm deferring the crown to that wheelchair girl. Are you going, Alex? Are we supposed to still spike the punch or just bring in flasks? Uh, maybe? I don't know. The urge strikes to cut a rug in front of that one Go on a book tour, make a video game out of this or something. Yeah, I know. Dun dun dun. And then they went on to be game developers. Oh, uh, sure. I mean, only if you want to. Of course I want to. I'm asking you to. We'll go to Reggie's. If you can find a stained one, you get 50% off. Nice. All right, you know what? It's picture time. Oh my god. Come on. No, no. Yeah, yeah, we should do it. Like, I can 100% this thing. game if you take all the um, photos. Noteworthy. Noteworthy. That is the way to say it. Yeah, I'd probably say it another way. Let's, um, let's actually move outside so we can get the light. Okay, sure. okay. Ren, what is that book, anyway? I don't know. I can oh. hardly make heads or tails out of what the hell he's <laughs> talking about at the time. Here's good for the, yeah, just here. Like, look. I'll just pick, like... This here. When I was younger, I could remember anything, whether it happened or not. But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any, but the things that never happened. Well, that's a bit deep, yeah, isn't it? I, I don't know. Okay, everyone. Cheese. Cheese. Oh, am I gonna get the picture? Am I gonna get a picture? Ah, oh, that's nice. Not a creepy that's ghost not in bad. sight. I told my mom I was spending the night at a friend's house, and when I got back, I didn't see any reason to change that story. And you know what? I still don't. Oh. The island did one good thing. Matchmaker achievement. Together, <laughs> which is nice because they're still together, actually, though they go to different schools now. Trying out the long distance thing, I guess. Ah, me and sixty-nine percent of players. Brought Ren and Nona together. 
Clarissa left to study English literature. She was thinking of dropping out, but is keeping at it for now. We talk sometimes. Rarely, but sometimes. I hear she's scared of the ocean now. Oh dear. And she got a dog too, if you care. Oh, I always care about the dog. Oh wow. You have 55% of players. What? Look at all those options though. One, two, three, four, five mm. options. Mm. Yeah. Jonas was the first to introduce me as a sister. Oh, achievement unlocked. You know, without the step part in front of it. And it was weird at first, but it's the truth. He's my brother. He goes to school in town and we see each other a lot. Six months of bonding with your new stepbrother Jonas. Like, what are <laughs> X percent of you sacrificed into the void? What happened on the island used to pop into my head every single day. And then every other day. And then a week went by and I realized I hadn't thought about it at all. I guess that's... I don't know. It's good, I think. But anyways, I, um... Well, if it matters, I left town to go to school. Undeclared. I need time to figure out what I, what I want. I guess. Oh. Uh. But anyways, <laughs> what time is it? <gasps> yeah, sorry, I gotta run, or I'll miss the ferry. Run's dragging me out to Edwards Island for that yearly beach party thing, and I have to pick up what's his name, Jonas. Oh no. <sighs> I hope he's not weird or mean oh, or no. something. Oh no. Whatever. I'm sure it'll be fun. It's something to do, right? Uh oh, did that just loop at the end? Oh, that is fucked up. <laughs> You're reliving that fairy ride forever. No. Oh no. Well, until that happens at the end, and that may just happen in every ending, I was gonna say, without spoiling too much, that I think you got the second best ending. You reckon? Look at that! Look at, look at Ghost Alex! In the credits. Oh. Get to cool. Yeah. And no wave. Ghost Alex in the woods. Is um. What's his? Is um Stuart. <laughs> the change of quality to be percentage of your choices contributed to the result you got with each character. Oh okay. So what did I do wrong? It must have been like well some of those choices so, at the end, right? Uh, there's like a, this, this is subjective. Spoilers for anyone who's going to play this game. Uh, why I think you got the second best ending is because there's one more ending. There's several more endings, but there's one more ending above that, I would say, where you can revive Michael. Mm. And he doesn't drown. Mm. And he's on the boat with you at the end. Oh, man. Uh... But does that, you know, that kind of bait and switch thing happen in all of the endings, though? I wonder. I don't know. It probably does. Because that seems like the kind of horrible thing they might do. <laughs> like, this, then there's no good ending. <laughs> One's trapped forever. I was quite pleased with how that went, though. Um, my friend got that ending, but I don't know how to get it myself. Mm. So what you have to do, my understanding, is that you have to convince Michael to stay at home. Oh, right. He stays at home, so he never goes to the place where he drowns. But you can also, it's very difficult, but apparently, and I think you were almost at it, you can keep him, it, like the easiest way to make him stay at home is to not be in a relationship with Clarissa, but you can get an ending where he is in a relationship with Clarissa and he survives. Um, so that's like the best ending, I think, everyone. Um, that's really sad, it, but it's, you know, like, um. I was gonna say, like, I feel it's like the Bay before Bay choice. In I feel like this is the best normal ending, because like yeah, yeah, because I feel like the reviving Michael seems a bit far. Yeah, it does feel a bit. Oh, okay, the time loop thing has happened every time to me so far. Okay, that feels that's reassuring. That is. Oh, hey, it was made in Unity. I thought that. Okay. So yeah, it doesn't look like you can, if if that's always gonna happen, it's kind of creepy. Hmm. Do you want to know about the other endings? Um, yeah, sure, why not? I mean, we're here, so... Okay, there's an ending where you can make Ren hate you. Oh. You were on that path, but you broke it. You fixed it. By saying sorry? Uh, yeah, basically. 
Uh, he did eat the brownie, and I was legit mad at him, though. <laughs> uh, there were two more steps to make him hate you, and you, you weren't going to do them anyway. It was rescue Clarissa first. Oh, okay. never did. You rescued him first. Well, yeah. And also plot with the ghosts to get rid of Clarissa and tell Ren about it. That's, that's just shady. Pr- Dude, that's just shady, yeah. That's uh, really shady. You've also got make uh, Jonas hate you. Oh, no. You can plot the, with the ghosts to get rid of Clarissa and tell Jonas about it. Whoa. You can blame Jonas for lots of mistakes. Wow. You can leave Jonas behind when you go to the parks office. Oh, my God. Uh, and you can prevent Jonas from using the time rewinder just before the final encounter. Oh, wow. When they hear some music play for the last time. Um, to make Clarissa hate you at the uh, game's end. That must be the easiest you, thing to do. <laughs> uh, apparently, just agree to the ghost proposal to betray Clarissa. <gasps> but, but this is even worse, right? That's early on. You can obliterate Clarissa from ever existing. Wow. Wow. To make it as though Clarissa never existed, you can exit via the last portal during the final encounter with the ghosts. So you, I think oh, you so take... she, you, she sacrifice, you sacrifice her yeah. to the ghost? And At the she... very end, and I think she just cut out of everything. Oh, that's rude. <laughs> um, get Ren and Nona together. Yeah. Uh, and that's the ending you got with Clarissa yeah. alive. Yeah. Um, so encourage dating all the way through the game. And also make up with Clarissa. Um, Captain says, from what I can tell, your past endings can affect future playthroughs. She hated me, and I didn't do either of those. Oh, weird. Huh. But, yeah, maybe it, it must be. You know, the conversation choices play a part in that, don't they? Because you know, like where deals as you're talking to various characters, and your thought yeah. bubbles with the image of the character pops into their heads and things. That's like obviously like you know, friendship plus one or whatever. Um, rivalry, plus one. Um. But like <sighs> that was deep. Um, sorry. What else can you just say? You can match make Rin and Nona, and then is yes. there anything else? Uh, then there's the Michael alive, and then a separate Michael alive with Clarissa uh, together. Now, I'm seeing in the comments, and it's not listed in this ending page. Mm-hmm. Discussion going on in the comments. And apparently, there was a DLC released. Oh really? Uh, and it's I think it's just included by default in the console version, or. And it's like a new game plus. Like it could be this could be nonsense, uh, but it suggests that it only works on new game plus. So once you've got knowledge of the game, mm. uh, and it's it'll apparently allow Alex to escape the time loop. Oh, that would be the best. That ending. would be the replay the factor right in there, wouldn't it? Yeah. Um, Captain says Clarissa was sorry. He got to talk to Michael again, and she didn't. <laughs> yeah, I was a bit worried bringing up Michael at the end there, like whether Clarissa would be all like, mm, or not. But I don't know. As long as she didn't realise what was happening to her all that time, <laughs> I'm, sh- I'm sure it's like all fine. Wow. Um, okay, so yeah, that's it. What do I play next week? <laughs> I don't know. God, I don't know what to follow that with. Something cheerful, um, something silly. Um, I guess, like, I should. I should wrap up there. That's like a lot to. A lot to digest. A lot to digest just before bedtime. You're right, um, Captain. I can imagine you being like at five thirty in the morning, just like. <laughs> I feel like that's what I'm going to be like. It's like ten p.m. now. I'm like. I'm just lying awake in bed, like. Just thinking about all of that. Uh, where are you seeing the DLCs? The one shown on Steam is the soundtrack. Yeah, uh, I'm is not seeing like the DLC cl- on Steam, but I have found a video with evidence of this ending. Oh, really? I, I have. I accidentally jumped through a little bit, and it, and it, yeah, it's somewhere. It's something completely different. Okay, that's interesting. Um, so I there th- is a there is another ending. But you said by available by default on the console version, but it doesn't look like Steam. Yeah, so Steam. maybe maybe they've just added it to the PC. Yeah, maybe they just added it and not said it is a. Yeah. Um, like- like a, a, DLC, right? a DLC. Maybe they've just pushed it as a regular update. That might be interesting. Well, Captain, it looks like you're going to have to go and play through this again. Then. <laughs> 
Um, but me, I think I'm done. I don't want to play this again. I can't. I can't yeah, it's, it. it's 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 from what I'm reading here. It sounds like a Groundhog Day situation. Oh really? Where she's she has lived through this nightmare, this game like hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of times, and then figures out. That she's stuck in, she figures out that the loop is like this big. Yeah. Um, wow. Well, anyway, I guess I'd, I'd better call it there. Thank you for joining me again, Scott. Um, for this whole journey. Um, Excellent. And thank yes, you to uh, Captain uh, for sticking around. <laughs> yeah, thank you for sticking around for this whole stream. Uh, and uh, if you enjoyed it, please give us a follow. Uh, I will be streaming multiplayer shenanigans of some description, I don't know what. On uh oh, he has given us a follow. Uh, they have given us a follow. Thank you. Uh, um, yeah, we'll be streaming some sort of multiplayer shenanigans on Friday or something. Uh, 8 p.m. BST, and uh, and then we're getting prepped for E3, so it might be a bit busy. Oh, actually, we're there. streaming tomorrow, aren't we? Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah. Oh, you're not here though, are you? I might not be back in time. I might be. Um, we'll see. That's fine. It probably means I'm hosting again then. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, it's fine. It's fine. Um, the board meeting. So we're going to be playing. Um, we're going to be playing some tabletop simulator tomorrow. So evening. tomorrow night, a little bit earlier. About and be... seven p.m. BST. So yeah, maybe like three playing. hours earlier than now. No problem. Thanks for the great stream. I'm sure to be back. Oh, that's excellent. I'm glad Ta-ra. you enjoyed Thank it. Thank you very much, and hope to see you again soon. Um, right, I'm going to put up the thank you soon. Okay, so bye bye. Bye-bye from Stitch as well. Bye-bye. Wait. <laughs> ah, okay, so if you want, you can check out more of our stuff at ready upnet You can follow us on Twitter Facebook at ReadyUp. And we are on YouTube at Ready Up Video. Obviously, we stream here, so we'll see you maybe tomorrow evening about 7pm BST or on Friday, so 8pm BST for multiplayer fun. And I do this every Monday. 8 p.m. BST. So thank you for joining us and thanks to you, Scott, and good night and a good rest of the week if we don't see you. Bye! Bye!